the Registry of Political Parties would like to promote existing political parties as institutions that live on through their legacy and ideologies. Director of Policy and Research at the Registry of Political Parties, Emmanuel Pork, says his office would like to strengthen political parties. This year has seen a total number of 44 political parties register for the upcoming elections. While some candidates would prefer to go into the elections as independents, Emmanuel Pock from the Registry of Political Parties says when people believe in a party's principles and policies, they stick to one party. Political parties are based on ideologies which like-minded people come together and form. He was speaking at the PNG National Party Convention 2017 where party leader Karen Gakua endorsed 55 candidates. We want the political parties to be institutions, right? As you can see up there, Mr. Tako, Oku, Pora and Kavali has left the party but the party still exists today. Since 2000, uh, since 1969, when the party was established, you know, if it was a human being, it would have died, right? But it's an institution, that's why it has come this far. And the party has grown the leadership, and the party has taken uh, on board responsibilities for the party, and uh, they drove the information, or they drove the agenda for the political party this far. Mr. Pork used the PNG National Party as an example of political parties existing as institutions, despite their deceased founding fathers in the likes of the late Se Yambaki Okuk, Thomas Cavalli and Paul Pora. Our political culture has been uh, driven towards personalities. When you see, when you see, uh, say, Mike, say uh, Michael Somari, uh, you vote for that person, right? And of Pango Party or National Alliance, the, the, the face of the party comes behind the personality. Since 2000, when the office was uh, established, we're trying to uh, drive the uh, information out to the people that political, people must be, uh, be members of political parties. While many have criticized the number of political parties this year, Mr. Pork says it is a democratic right. He also confirmed that 12 political parties have been deregistered as of last year. Some have been fined hefty amounts, while some had sitting members of parliament.